Job to work every morning. <laughs> go, go, gadget legs. your work, but this is ridiculous. You look awful. You really should do something about the shape you're in. Gadget, I've been looking into your file, and I think you've earned yourself a few days off. Chief, it couldn't come at a better time. I've just won a week at a new health spa. Hmm. Why don't you come with me? It would give you a chance to get outdoors. No, Gadget. I'm ordering you to take that prize. I need the rest. Anything you say, Chief. Oh, at last, an assignment that didn't blow up in my face. By the way, Chief. Hmm, that's funny. He was here a moment ago. <laughs> so, Gadget, you accepted my little invitation. He will never guess that the Baidui Spa is really a mad trap set to destroy him. This time he won't escape, a eh, mad cat? Here's to your health, Inspector Gadget. But Uncle Gadget, I don't remember you entering any contest. That's the beauty of these modern lotteries, Penny. Everyone gets a chance. They probably just drew my name out of a hat. That sounds very strange. Be careful, Uncle! Mm. Brain, follow Uncle Gadget and stay close to him. Got a sneaky suspicion I'm being followed by a mad agent, no doubt. This may help you get a grip on things. Scratch one mad agent. Ah, the Bite Wee Health Spa.
My name is Gadget, but don't ask me what I do for a living. Because it's top secret and I won't be able to tell you. So please don't ask. I'm Madame. Your activities director. You'll enjoy your stay here. I guarantee it. We're completely at your service. You're our only guest at the moment, so you'll be getting special treatment. That's very gracious of you, madam. But I'm sure any treatment I receive from you would be special. Where do we start? Shall we try the gym? That's a brilliant idea. No wonder you're in charge here. I want you to know that I'm an expert at indoor sports. is ready for our guest. You know I've promised him our special treatment. Hi, guys. I'm here for a whole week. Ah, a punching bag. I used to be pretty good at this. Float like a butterfly, sting like a bee. That was my mother. <laughs> or was it the other way around? I think... A man of your build would be more challenged by the weights. Strange you noticed. This body is a finely tuned instrument, capable of amazing feats of strength. <laughs> See? What did I tell you, madam? <clears throat> a finely tuned <clears throat> instrument. Sorry about that. Maybe the old tuning's just a little off. I'll have to get my mechanic to check it over. Let's test your reflexes. Catch! They say the hand is quicker than the eye, but the gadget hand is even quicker. <gasps> A hole in one. Somebody at the door? No, no, it's nothing. These look interesting. What do I do with them? Oh, I'm sure a man of your natural abilities will soon get the hang of the rings. This is a piece of cake. <laughs> Madam, you ought to have your equipment checked more often. Somebody could get hurt. You're so light on your feet. I don't think anything could hurt you. But then, of course, you haven't tried my special gym mats. Try a vault or two. I do so admire grace in a man. Ah. Should have warned you, madam. I have an unfair advantage. My natural ability gives me the reach of ten ordinary men. You're right. You are extraordinary. How about one more exercise to put the spring back in your step? There's 
there's nothing like a good workout to get the old gadget body in shape. All work and no play makes Gadget a dull boy. <laughs> Your body looks pretty good to me. All you need now is a good steam bath to relax your muscles. That sounds great. A little steam keeps you on the beam. That's what I always say. Brain, are you all right? Where's Uncle Gadget? Is he in danger? <laughs> Hold on, Brain. I'm on my way. Hot enough for you, Mr. Gadget? Maybe you could turn up the air conditioning just a little. <laughs> How's that? Uh, much better, thanks. Make sure that our client is well taken care of. <laughs> you can count on us. <laughs> the Dr. Claw wants to talk to you. He does? Uh, oh. Brain! <laughs> Where have you been? <laughs> out of this one, I promise you. He'd better not. I'm beginning to lose patience. Who's there? <laughs> well, what have we here? I found her snooping around outside. Now! What should I do with her? Lock her in the basement. Lock her in the basement. I give the orders. Oh, my apologies, Dr. Claw. Dr. Claw! Whew. Why didn't I think of this before? A glass of ice water would certainly hit the spot. Hello, room service? Hello? Hello? Hmm. This is a very strong door, made specially by my grandfather. Sorry to bother you, but no one's answering room service. And a glass of ice water would be nice. I'd like to see him try and open it now. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry to disturb you again, but I forgot to take off my watch. Could you put it somewhere safe? I told you... Stay inside! It's Madame's orders! I wonder why they're so angry. Maybe it's because I forgot to thank them. Did you see what I saw? Yeah! A walking plant! Plants don't walk. Ooh. Come on, after it. Hmm, the two fellows left. Must be a time lock on the door. Oh well, now for some exercise. <laughs> Madam. Tell Madame before she finds out herself. Well, what do you know? An exercise room. Things sure have changed since I was a kid. One, two. One, two. Oh, Brain, thank goodness you're here. for good should be easy. <gasps> 102, 103, 104. Ah, madam, good to see you. You know, I've never seen an exercise room quite like this one. And it will probably be the last one you'll ever see. Why don't you try this? Well, why not? Nothing like 
like a good stretch, eh, Inspector Gadget? Oh, that's wonderful for the back. When do we eat? All this exercise has given me quite an appetite. Good. I want to prepare a special meal just for you. <laughs> Wonderful. Then I think I'll get some air. Ah, great to be alive. Your inefficiency is making me very angry. Forget your sniveling. I want Gadget eliminated now! Where'd she go? They're up to something, Brain. Follow them. I'll be okay. It's almost dinner time. Gadget should be hungry by now. Make sure you put your potion on everything that Gadget might want to eat. Don't worry. One drop of this, and Gadget will be a pussycat in Claw's hands. <laughs> is dinner almost ready? I'm starving. There he is. Is everything all right with Uncle Gadget? <laughs> and Dan's going to drug Uncle Gadget? We'll stay with him and don't let him eat anything. Chief Quimby, we found stolen jewels at the health spa. Hurry! I am famished! All this exercise has sure built up my appetite. This is fresh out of the oven. Have a slice of my special bread. Thank you. There's nothing as delicious as homemade bread. Yeah, nice, fresh, soft bread. <laughs> Your lamb chop must be ready by now. Make sure you eat every last bite. I might even eat the plate. <laughs> <laughs> go, go, gadget neck. Inspector. Well, how do you feel? You ate it all? It was very tasty. I thought you might like some salad with your chop. I have to have a word with the cook. Ah. <laughs> you didn't eat all your salad. <laughs> I was just tossing it. A nice piece of fruit? <gasps> I'll be back in a minute. Yo! Your potion doesn't work! I can't understand it. He must be really tough. Then let's give him my dynamite cake. <laughs> He'll get a real bang out of this. There's something funny going on here. The cook made this just for you. Oh, how thoughtful. And it isn't even my birthday. But won't you have a piece? No, thanks. It's fattening. <gasps> Uncle Gary, no! Wowzers. Oh, boy. OK, 
Okay, take him away. Congratulations, Gadget. You did it again. I did? Well, I'm terribly sorry. No congratulations for finding the jewels, Gadget. Even when you're on vacation, you're still on duty. Chief, I'm always on duty. And we're glad you are, Uncle Gadget. <laughs> <laughs> What are you going to do with the rest of your vacation, Uncle Gadget? Penny, I'm going back to the city for a little peace and quiet. Staying in shape is harder than I thought. From now on, I'm going to take it a little bit at a time. But, Uncle, you got fresh air and exercise. Don't you feel better for it? Yes, Penny, but you don't have to come all the way to the country to improve your health. You can start in your own home. Exercise daily. I think I'll jog to work every morning. And maybe I'll go swimming once a week. I could exercise my gadgets, but Dr. Claw lets me do that all the time.